Hi everyone, Trashfellow here and today I'm about to review another Dawn of the Dead edition that came out in Japan. Well, this edition actually came out in the year 1995. But before I begin to do my review, I will shortly talk a little bit about um, all the other versions that came out around this version. Well, in 1994 the label called Emotion Gaga um, issued two VHS videos. Well, the first edition uh, was the so-called Director's Cut with um, the um, um, elevator burst cover, same as the one I showed last time uh, on my vid, which is actually this cover. Um, and um, yeah, the second uh, VHS tape came out in the same year and was the 119 minutes, uh, minute long um, Argento cut. And that version actually had um, a cover of the zombie crowd in that Italian art. Well, jumping back to this edition that has been released in March 1995, can be considered as a re-release of the 1994 already been released VHS tape. This time the tape actually, as you can see, has a different cover on the front. Uh, we do have a, a chrome version of uh, the cover, which, um, yeah, I think you can see quite good here in, uh, in the camera. It does look perfect, I think. Um, has uh, here above the George A. Romero, then uh, Zombie Dawn of the Dead. And uh, this is how the spine looks. And here we can already see that, um, yeah, this um, has as well as the Victor VHS tape, the elevator burst cover here on the side. Comparing the two covers, we can actually see here on the left side, which is uh, the um, Emotion Gaga uh, VHS tape and here the Victor VHS tape. They do look um, very, very similar. And um, yeah, getting a closer look at the whole spine of the VHS tape, we can actually see that they differ from each other. Well, but jumping back to uh, this VHS tape, um, here we do have the Japanese title um, again. Um, does look very great. And here is the back cover um, with uh, yeah some content about uh, the story. And um, here we can see that it is the 139 minute long version of the movie. Concerning the different versions of Dawn of the Dead, and there are actually quite a lot, uh, this can be considered as the long version, or also called the extended cut, um, that was um, initially made for laser discs um, in um, the middle of the 90s especially for the American market. Although uh, Romero actually didn't like uh, this version, um, this is actually the most common version in the US. Another thing that is very very special about this VHS tape is that we do have actually a reversible cover. Now taking a closer look at the cover, here's the side that we already have seen and um, yeah, turning it around Here's actually the other side, and as I already showed it on uh, the spine, here is, um, yeah, again the front cover that uh, does look um, very similar to the spine. Here again the back, which does look equal to the back cover from uh, the other side, but with this kind of yellow tone, which I really do love. And um, yeah, that is basically it for the cover. Now opening up this uh, VHS tape, it does open in a different way because you um, normally you pull um, this out but here you have to pull um, here a button down and then it opens up and um, yeah, taking a closer look at the VHS tape, 
I think this is, has been taken from a rental store because here's still a sticker on and um, seems to be uh, approval for a um, for uh, for a rental store but I'm not pretty sure um, here is the sticker above in a really really great shape uh, no really marks on it and the spine I really do love this orange tone here um, yeah I do have here a scratch but um, yeah nevertheless it looks very very nice and uh, same as on the spine um, on um, the other side of the VHS tape we do have here the Japanese title again very great so guys that is that is it for this VHS tape uh, just a short addition um, together with this VHS tape there also came out a, pr a pretty big a laser disc box with the title the perfect collection um, but that is probably something for my next vid so um, yeah guys hope you enjoyed this vid as much as I did and I hope to see you all next time